Hey everyone, I'm Patrick from Oakland Travel, and it's Cozumel, Mexico, and it's at the end of our excursion, so we're heading back to the ship. This was January of 2022, a quick little five-night cruise out of Port Canaveral, Florida. And uh, Cozumel, Mexico, one of those places that uh, Maria and I have been to countless times over the years. I'm not even sure of the exact count. Cozumel is such a featured destination on Royal, uh, Western Caribbean itineraries that uh, a lot of the cruise lines make uh, regular trips to Cozumel. And uh, interestingly, during the cruise restart, Cozumel was one of the first places to basically be open and, and ready for business, so to speak, in terms of a port, you know, for the ships to call on. So um, we've been here so many times over the years, done all sorts of different types of excursions. And, you know, it's, uh, it's one of those things, if you look at the Western Caribbean layout, there's just so few places to go. You got Cozumel, you got Costa Maya, you got Honduras uh, on that Western side of the Caribbean Sea. And that's about it. Uh, you'd have to go over towards the center part of the Caribbean Sea where you know, Jamaica is and, and Haiti and stuff like that. And uh, sometimes those are considered to be a Western Caribbean itinerary, even though they're not really Western, so to speak. They're sort of like central, but the cruise lines uh, kind of do like a delineation of Puerto Rico and they do anything sort of west of Puerto Rico as being quote, Western Caribbean. So that's why Cozumel ends up being on so many itineraries because there's just so few places to go over there. But you know, it's a great place, um, lots to do beautiful water. Uh, it's really good for water activities. We've done helmet dives. We've done snorkeling over the years, all kinds of stuff. After this, we have a day at sea, and then we're back into Port Canaveral at the end of the cruise. If you like that cruising and travel lifestyle, consider subscribing to our channel with the notification bell on so you don't miss any of the vlog episodes that we put up on the channel similar to this one. We also put up shorts on a daily basis, plus we go live every Wednesday night for the cruise and travel discussion. If you want to show your support for the channel, hit the like button on this video. Lots of water activities to do in Cozumel. We've done uh, the helmet dive. Uh, let's see what else have we done? We did the uh, drive your jet, uh, drive your own speedboat, uh, which included some snorkeling, which was really good. We're gonna do uh, Tulu Tulum ruins with the sea note, so no take. But it's canceled because of the tour operator didn't want to run the tour weather and stuff. Even though the weather today is not bad, it seemed to clear up pretty quickly. Oh yeah, big time. <clears throat> yep. And that water was definitely pushing it around. I mean, because when we say, oh, it's a smaller ship than Oasis. <laughs> yeah, but it's freaking huge. <laughs> Still was pushed around so much. Yep. Oasis of the Seas is a good, uh, this is saying probably 140,000 tons, so 225,000 tons on the Oasis class. It's quite a bit uh, heavier and quite a bit bigger. All right. 